so much to learn about It'll make you want to shout Blippi! me Blippi and look at where I am. Today I'm at the Peterson Automotive Museum in Los Angeles, California and in this museum they have a lot of cars. They have old cars, new cars, and they might even have some fast cars. Cool! And I heard that actually we get to go down into the vault and see some really special cars. Let's go! <laughs> Whoa! There's so many cool cars here! Whoa! Look at this! Whoa! This one's really big. Do you see what it says? Police Patrol! Yeah! <laughs> Whoa! Look at this. This isn't a car. This looks like a motorcycle. And it looks like a motorcycle for space! And Mars. Here we come! <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> oh! Hey! Who are you? My name's Jason. Oh, nice to meet you, Jason. I'm Blippi. Nice to meet you, Blippi. <laughs> what kind of car is this? This is actually a hydrogen car. Hydrogen? Wait a second. Most cars run on gas, diesel, or electricity. What do you mean by hydrogen? Well, it runs on hydrogen just like you find in the air. Oh, so you put in hydrogen in this car, then what comes out of the exhaust pipe? Well, the hydrogen that you put in the tank combines with air it's getting through the front grill, the oxygen in the air mixes with the hydrogen to form water. Whoa, cool! So H2O, two hydrogen and one oxygen combined, yeah! Makes water! So cool! <laughs> Speaking of cool, why does it look so cool? Well, unlike most cars that come to you painted, this car you get to paint yourself. Yeah. And I have some markers for you to do that with. Oh, cool! So, like he says, Normal vehicles, you cannot paint or draw or decorate at all. But this vehicle, he says, I and you get to decorate. So cool. Whoa, can I decorate it? Of course you can. All Have right. fun, Blippi. All right, thank you. <laughs> wow, this is gonna be so much fun. Where should we start? Hmm, let's see. Um, about right here. <laughs> here we go, take some orange, color in those circles. Oh, cool. <laughs> All right, how about some blue? Oh, there we go. Nice little chimney. Oh, what about right there? <laughs> there we go. Looks like the car is complete. Wow, what a cool looking car now. And it's so colorful. Whoa. <laughs> Sure do love this car. <laughs> Wait a second, do you see that way over there? A blue car, and it looks like someone is working on it. Let's go say hi. <laughs> Whoa, hey, who are you? I'm Brad. Oh, nice to meet you, Brad. I'm Blippi. What are you doing here? We're just getting this car ready for the Cinco de Mayo show. Whoa, a car show? Car shows are so cool. All the cars line up, and then all these people walk around and check out the really cool cars. Whoa, how big is this engine? 327. Wow, how many cylinders does it have? Six cylinders. Six cylinders. Are they all in a line for an inline six or is it a V6? This is a V6. Whoa, cool. So three cylinders on this side, three on this side, and then it looks like the letter V. Cool. Have you added oil to it yet? Not yet. We're just getting ready to now. Cool. Can we check it together? Yes, sir. Whoa, cool. Whoa, there it is. Oh, looks like the oil is nice and full. Cool. Hey, Brad, what's this plastic here for? This is to protect the car to make sure we don't scratch it or get it dirty. Oh, that's very smart. Hey, do you mind if we check out the inside of the car? No problem. Awesome. <laughs> I'm so excited. I wonder what it looks like. <laughs> Whoa, wait a second. Do you see there's no door handles? Huh, Brad, how do you get inside? You lower the windows with a key fob, and okay. then you reach inside and there's a handle inside. Oh, cool. So when the window is down, then you can open up the door. Whoa, check it out.
Wow, that's a cool looking inside. <laughs> do you mind if I sit inside? Please do. Whoa! All right, here I go. <laughs> Whoa! It's a really tight squeeze in here. Do you see how short the roof is? Yeah, it used to be taller, but then they shortened it. Whoa! And the inside is blue and white. Blue is one of my two favorite colors. <laughs> you knew that already. Whoa, and look at the steering wheel. It's so shiny. Me, me, me. Whoa, and all these gauges and gadgets and levers. Whoa, the car looks pretty old. I wonder how old this car is. Hey, let me ask Brad. <laughs> That is a really cool car, Brad. How old is this car? That's a 1937. Wait a second. Is that 85 years old? 85 years old. Whoa, 85 years old to this date right now. Now that is a really old car. Do you have any other old cars? Sure, we have a 1957 Chevy right over here. Can we see? Yes, sir. Sure. Let's go. <laughs> Whoa, what kind of car is this, Brad? This is a 1957 Chevrolet Bel Air convertible. Cool! And do you see the color? It's the color green! Whoa! And like Brad said, it's a convertible. Do you see how there's no roof? Yeah, so then you can drive along and have the wind blowing your hair. So cool! Woo! And what's so unique about this car? What I think is unique about this car are the wings. The wings? Is that this? Yeah. Wow, cool! One of the neat things about the wings are if you open this up, this is where you put the fuel in. Whoa, do you see that? Yeah, that's where you put the fuel in. in. Most cars, you put it in on the side. Cool. Whoa, speaking of cool, what's this giant circle? That's the spare tire. Oh, that's really practical. So then, if you ever get a flat tire, you have a spare tire. Cool. <gasps> Whoa, speaking of cool, what kind of car is this, Brad? This is a 1910 Model T. Whoa, a 1910 Model T. Oh yeah, that's done by Ford. This is a really old car. Is this the first kind of car in America? This is one of the first cars built in America. Wow, cool. And uh, how do you start it? Is there a key? There's no key for this car, Blippi. This car, you turn this handle right here on, crank it over, and that's how you start it. Whoa, do you see this handle? Brad said you crank it and turn it, and then that's how the car starts. Awesome! <laughs> do you mind if I sit inside? Please do, Blippi. Cool! All right. Whoa! Whoa! Now this car is really old! Whoa! Look at me! I'm driving in history! <laughs> cool! Was this car really fast, Brad? No, this car was very slow. Oh, so it's old and slow. Do you have any old and fast cars? Yeah, right here. We have a 1947 Indy car. Cool, let's go check it out. Whoa, yeah, whoa. What a cool race car. What kind of car is this, Brad? This is a 1946 Ross Page Special. Wow, a really old race car. That is so cool. Did it go super fast? It went about 125 miles per hour. Wow, that is fast. That's about 200 kilometers an hour. Whoa, and look down here. Whoa, it even has a seat belt. Whoa, a very old looking seat belt. <laughs> yeah, and what's this right here, Brad? That's the gear shift lever. Oh, so how many gears does this car have? Only one gear in this car, Blippi. Only one gear? Yeah, normal cars these days have many, many gears. Yeah, five, six, right around there. And that's why they sound like ring, ring, ring. <laughs> huh, cool. Whoa, do you mind if I take it for a spin? Take it for a spin, good luck. All right, here we go. Let's start the race in three, two, one. Whoa, yeah, this car is fast. Whoa. Look at the crowd! Hey, crowd! Whoa! Ooh, and the flagger? Yeah, they tell me what lap I'm on. So cool! Whoa! Whoa! It's a lot of old cars. Wow, cool! Hey, wait a second. Whoa! Maybe we can find the oldest car here. Let's go! Whoa! Whoa! Check it out! This is a Ford Model A! And this looks like a very old vehicle. Wow, it doesn't even look like a car, because it looks really big. 
hey, this is a station wagon. Oh, and do you see the doors? Yeah, they look like they're made of wood. And I actually got permission to open it up. So, should I open it up? Yeah! Hello! Wow! So old! Wow! I wonder if we can find another old car. Maybe an even older one. Yeah! Cool! Another really old car! This is actually a 1918 Model T. Wow, so old! And just like the other car, I got permission to open the door. <laughs> Whoa, check it out! Wow, now that is an old car. And check this out down here. Whoa, do you see this? Do you know what this is? Yeah, a toolbox! Whoa! <laughs> yeah, you can put your screwdriver in there, pair of pliers, even a wrench. Cool! Let's go see if we can find an even older car! <laughs> Whoa! Cool! Another really old car! Whoa! It's the color red, black, ooh, there's even some shiny gold! This is a 1903 Cadillac Model A! <laughs> I wonder where the engine is. Huh, I don't know, do you see it? <gasps> Wait a second. Maybe the engine is where the trunk normally is. I got permission to open it up. <laughs> Whoa, yeah, the engine. Now that is an old engine, cool. <laughs> wow, I love cars and I love old cars. I wonder if we can find an even older car. Yeah! Whoa! Check it out! Now this is an old car! Whoa! This car is so old! Actually, this car is from 1886. Yeah, it's actually one of the very first practical cars in the world! When it's so old, it doesn't even have a steering wheel. You see? Kind of looks like a steering lever. <laughs> cool. Ooh, and down here, wow. Yeah, the wheel and tire. Doesn't it kind of look like it's from a bicycle? <laughs> but it's not. <laughs> wow, and the seat looks pretty comfortable, I guess. Oh, and back here, this is the engine. So powerful. <laughs> Just kidding. This only could drive about 10 miles an hour. That's about 16 kilometers an hour. <laughs> And how you started it is with this flywheel. You would grab on and turn it and push it. It was really hard to start. Cool. Well, I had so much fun finding all these old cars with you. Good job. <laughs> Whoa. Wow, wasn't that so much fun? I know, it was. Wow, I really enjoyed learning about those really old cars. Oh, and those really old cars that were also super fun. Whoa! And you can't forget about that car that ran on hydrogen. Whoa! So cool! I love decorating it. So colorful. <laughs> well, this is the end of this video. But if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with me? Yeah! B-L-I-P-P-I. -P -P -I. Flippy! Good job! All right. See you again. Bye-bye. <laughs>
<laughs> These are my monster truck toys. This monster truck's name is Grave Digger. <laughs> this monster truck's name is Grave Digger. <laughs> and this monster truck's name is Grave Digger. <laughs> <laughs> oh. I have three monster truck toys. One, two, three. <laughs> I have two monster truck toys. One, two. I have one monster truck toy. I have zero monster truck toys. <laughs> One, two, three. <laughs> three monster truck toys. <laughs> Look at this grave digger. Let's learn the shapes that make up this grave digger. Okay, the wheels and the tires, yeah, they're circle. One, two. There's two circles. Oh, but then there's two on the other side, so there's actually four circles, four wheels, and four tires. <laughs> okay, and then uh, the body, yeah, the body of the monster truck. It's kind of a weird shape, but let's break it down into two smaller shapes, okay? So this right here, yeah, we can make that a rectangle. And then this front part where the engine is, um, yeah, we can make it another rectangle. So two rectangles and then four circles. You only can see two though. <laughs> Whoa, I loved learning my shapes with you with this Grave Digger monster truck toy. Okay, enough playing with these monster truck toys. Let's watch some real monster trucks going off some jumps.
<laughs> that was really fun learning our shapes and a little bit of counting with these monster truck toys. <laughs> hey, it's me, Flippy. And today we're here at Dogwood Canyon Nature Park in Lampy, Missouri. <laughs> and you and I get to go horseback riding. <laughs> yeah, we're gonna get to see some horses and feed them yummy snacks and even go for a ride. Woohoo! This is gonna be so much fun. Come on. Whoa, check it out. We're here inside the stables and I can't wait to meet all the cute horses here. <laughs> hey, do you know what sound a horse makes? <laughs> yeah, they make a neighing sound, kind of like this. Hey! <laughs> oh, can you make a neighing sound too? <laughs> yeah, awesome, good job. Hey, I have an idea. Let's act like horses together. Okay, here we go. <laughs> Time to do some trotting and some galloping. <laughs> Nay! Whoa! <laughs> that was pretty silly. <laughs> Ooh, but maybe there's a horse we can go say hello to. Oh, well, look. <laughs> oh, hello there. Hi. <laughs> Oh, oh, hi, what's your name? My name's Chance. Oh, it's nice to meet you, Chance. I'm Blippi. <laughs> and who is this? This is Max. Whoa, hi, Max. Can I give Max a pet? You sure can. I'll even let you give him a treat. Oh, okay. Ooh, hi. Oh, <laughs> whoa. Just hold your hand out flat. Yeah. What kind of treat is that? That's an alfalfa cube. I'm getting ready to feed him. Would you like to come? Whoa, yeah. <laughs> Max is one cute horse and we definitely want to make sure Max has all the yummy food. <laughs> Whoa, check it out! It's a giant tractor! <laughs> Whoa, Chance, what's this for? We need it to carry all this hay to feed the horses. Oh well, yeah, there's a lot of hay over here. And horses love to eat it up. <laughs> well, you think I could drive the tractor? You sure can. You want to jump up there and follow me? Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, and I've driven a lot of tractors before. <laughs> Ooh, let's go! <laughs> Here we go. Woo! Whoa, look, we found another horse. Ah, oh, you are so beautiful. <laughs> oh, and what, what's this horse's name? This is Charlie. Oh, hi, Charlie. <laughs> can I give Charlie a pet? You can, you <laughs> sure can. Okay, hi, Charlie. <laughs> Aw, you are so sweet. <laughs> oh, and what kind of horse is Charlie? Charlie is a paint horse. Oh, a paint horse. Whoa, <laughs> you see, Charlie is the color white and the color brown. <laughs> Yeah, that makes sense. A paint horse that's two different colors. Like someone painted Charlie. Aw, <laughs> uh, you're so beautiful. <laughs> Whoa. Aw, uh, and Charlie is so soft too. Whoa. <laughs> well, look, Charlie has some hair. Whoa. <laughs> whoa, that's the horse's mane, right? Yes, it is. Whoa, whoa, Charlie, you have a beautiful mane. <laughs> oh, well, Chance, do you think I could go on a ride? Yeah, if you'll let me. I think he's about done with his breakfast here and we'll <laughs> take oh, him yeah. out and <laughs> saddle him up. Yum! <laughs> Whoa, okay. Are you all done? <laughs> uh, <laughs> okay, I think it's time to ride. So first things first, we just need to take Charlie out. Yep. Okay. <laughs> here, I can take this. You want to take that? Yeah. <laughs> okay, and I'll grab him. Ooh. Step back a little bit. <laughs> Whoa, <laughs> here comes Charlie. <laughs> Whoa. Can you do me a favor? Sure. And go get that other cross tie over there? Okay. <laughs> oh, here you go. Thank you. Walk way around him. Oh, yeah. You don't want to get too close. <laughs> Ooh, and here you go. <laughs> oh. Charlie is so beautiful. Well, before we ride, what do we need to do first? Well, we gotta brush him. Mm, yeah, we wanna make sure Charlie is nice and clean. Ah, <laughs> yeah, and it's also important to check the hooves. Yeah, where the horseshoes are, <laughs> in case a rock or some dirt got there. Oh, Ooh. 
All right, these are what the things we're gonna use? Yeah, we've... Whoa, we have a brush, right? <laughs> That's a brush, and then the other's a curry comb. Whoa, a curry comb? Mm-hmm. Whoa, look at this. Whoa, yeah, it has all kinds of little edges, zigzags on it. Hmm. And what is this used for? That's to knock the dirt and the mud off. Whoa, yeah, off the bottom of the hooves. <laughs> okay, well, what should we do first? Well, let's first let's groom him where the saddle's gonna go. Everywhere where we put the saddle. Okay, well, here we go. <laughs> go like that. Ah, <laughs> it's so fun to brush, Charlie. Ah, yeah, and we want to clean off this area because the saddle is gonna go on top, and we don't want it to be uncomfortable for Charlie. <laughs> ah, okay. Well, that looks pretty good to me. <laughs> Next, we need to check his feet for dirt and debris. Mm -hmm. So I'm gonna see if he'll pick his foot up here for me. Whoa, Whoa that's pretty dirty. <laughs> Whoa, we definitely wanna get some of that off. Well, look, and you see, on the bottom of the hoof, there's a horseshoe. Well, why do horses need horseshoes? Cause it keeps the rocks from hurting their feet. Oh yeah, <laughs> so it's nice and comfy walking around. <laughs> Whoa, we brushed Charlie and we cleaned off the hooves, so what do we need to do next? Next, we need to saddle him up. Okay, well, let's go get a saddle. <laughs> Whoa, check it out! We're here in the saddle room. <laughs> oh, and Chance, why do we need a saddle? And because it helps you balance and then it helps keep your horse comfortable. Oh yeah, you definitely want to make sure the horse is nice and comfy. And it's nice if you're comfy too, right? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> well, it looks like there are a lot of saddles here. Looks like there's probably a lot of horses, right? <laughs> oh yeah, I think we've got 45 here. 45 horses? Whoa, that's a lot. <laughs> but we just need to find one saddle for Charlie, right? <laughs> yep. Okay, well, let's see which one's Charlie's. Hmm. Looks like, looks like there are names. See, Smoke and Corriente and Alex. <laughs> Whoa, look at this one. Blue, <laughs> I like that name. <laughs> and do you see it? Charlie, <laughs> yeah, we found Charlie's name. Oh, well, Chance, does that mean that this is Charlie's saddle? That is his tack. Whoa, yeah. Well, is it okay if I take it down? Yeah, go ahead. Be oh. careful though, it's heavy. Okay, here we go. <laughs> whoa, 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 whoa. This is really, really heavy. <laughs> yeah, look, really heavy and it has a seat. Hmm. And what's this here? That's a saddle horn. That's what you can hold on to if you need to. Oh yeah, definitely helps to keep your balance. <laughs> whoa, and what are these here? That'll be what you put your feet in. Those are called your stirrups. Whoa, look, stirrups. Whoa, yeah, you can just slide your shoe in right there. So you're nice and balanced and your feet aren't going all over the place. <laughs> oh, and what's this here? That's a saddle pad. That helps cushion the horse's back from the saddle. Whoa, yeah, it's nice and squishy, <laughs> really soft. So when you put on a heavy saddle, it's nice and comfy. Well, I think we should probably take these over to Charlie. <laughs> Let's go. Ooh, <laughs> hi, Charlie. <laughs> Whoa. So first we want to put on the saddle pad and then, ooh, maybe can you can take help that me? from you. Yeah. Oh, it's pretty heavy. <laughs> and then we put on the saddle. Whoa. Let's see. Here we go. Whoa. Ah, Charlie, that's a nice looking saddle you have over there. <laughs> so it looks like we need to put the saddle on the saddle pad and then Drop it in. <laughs> see. Whoa, so we put some straps under Charlie's belly, but what's this right here? This is a breast collar. Whoa, and what is that supposed to do? Keeps it from sliding too far side to side. Mm-hmm, yeah. If you're on a saddle on a horse, you wanna be nice and safe. You don't wanna be too wobbly, cause that could be uncomfortable for the horse, and it might be uncomfortable for you too. <laughs> Aw, Charlie, you are so sweet. <laughs> Thanks for letting us go on a ride with you. Oh, so there are one, two straps we wanna do? Three straps. Oh yeah. <laughs> one, two, three. <laughs> yeah, you don't wanna forget the front. <laughs> Whoa, <laughs> well, it looks like we've finished saddling Charlie. <laughs> and now what do we wanna do next? You wanna go ride? Yeah, <laughs> okay. 
go take Charlie out and go for a ride. <laughs> Whoa, I can't wait to ride Charlie. <laughs> oh, good thing I have on my helmet. Woohoo! <laughs> Whoa, check it out. <laughs> Whoa, <laughs> we're out here in the arena <laughs> and think we're just about ready to start riding. So what's the first thing I need to do? Okay, first thing, let him know that you're coming up here. Okay. <laughs> Give him a nice pat on the neck. Aw, Charlie, I'm gonna get up in the saddle. <laughs> okay, now let's put that foot okay. all the way up here. Grab your saddle horn. Okay. And then big quick up and over. Whoa, <laughs> thanks Charlie. Whoa, check it out. <laughs> Whoa, okay. this is so fun. Now sit nice <laughs> and even up there. Whoa, and then I hold the reins like this, right? Yep. Okay. And if I want to go forward, what do I say first? You're going to say walk up and give him a squeeze and then a kick with your legs if you need to. Okay, walk up. <laughs> Whoa, good, Charlie. <laughs> Here we go. <laughs> and if I want to stop, what do I say then? You're going to say whoa and pull back on the reins. Whoa. <laughs> Aw, Charlie, you are such a good horsey. <laughs> well, this is so fun. Now, I think it's time to go for a ride. <laughs> you ready to go out on the trail? Let's do it. Okay, time to go to the trail. Here we go. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> Whoa, check it out. We're here on the trail. <laughs> Whoa, Charlie, you're such a good horse. Oh, and Chance, thanks for riding with us. You're welcome, glad to have you out. Yeah, oh, and what's your horse's name? This is Smoke. Oh, hello, Smoke. Aw, <laughs> oh, Smoke looks like a good horsey, too. <laughs> Whoa, so nice to be out here on the trail. And it's getting a little bit warmer, too. If you notice, the green leaves are starting to change colors. Yeah, some of the green leaves are turning yellow or orange or red. <laughs> oh, Chance. Can you ride on the trail in all kinds of weather, like snow? Yeah, you just gotta watch for it being too slick. As long as the, the ground's firm, then you can ride. Oh, that definitely sounds fun, riding in the snow. But <laughs> I like this weather better. <laughs> it's not too cold. Today was awesome, yeah. We learned how to groom and saddle a horse. <laughs> and we met Charlie, we even got to go for a ride. Oh, and Chance, thank you so much for teaching us all about horses today. <laughs> Thanks for riding with me, come back and see us. <laughs> oh, I certainly would love to. <laughs> oh, and I'll see you too, Charlie. <laughs> well, that's the end of this video, but if you wanna watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. <laughs> hey, can you spell my name with me? Okay, here we go. <laughs> Ready? B L I P P I. Filippi. Good job. <laughs> well, I'll see you real soon. Bye bye. <laughs>
on an excavator. Got a place where workers sit, it's called the cab Where they control the bucket to scoop and grab I'm a whole regulator, I'm an excavator Oh, can't you see that I work all day? Do you ever sleep? No time for sleep, no time for play I'm an excavator Monster truck! Are you ready to learn about some monster trucks? Let's go! Oh, look at that! It's a giant monster truck! Let's check out some of the parts of the monster truck. Whoa! These? Yeah, are the wheels and tires. They're so big! All that in there? That's the gears and the suspension. There's so much stuff going on in there. Whoa! Yeah, the engine. The engine is right here. That's where the monster truck gets all of its power from. Ooh, and this, that big yellow thing, that's the body of the monster truck. Monster wheels and tires! Check it out! This green monster truck is doing a wheelie! Let's watch an instant replay and then watch a couple more monster truck wheelies!
Whoa! You're inside a real monster truck. Let me show you some of the parts. First off, you got in here because you went from the bottom. You get inside a monster truck from the bottom. And here's the first part I'll tell you about. This is the steering wheel. You steer the monster truck with this, okay? And then let's push the ignition button, which then flips on all of your gauges, like your oil temperature, transmission temp, and your, your tack, which is your rotations per minute of the engine. Whoa, and how you make that engine go vroom is down here is the gas pedal. Vroom, vroom, vroom. And then this is the brake. That's how you stop the monster truck. All right, now let's watch some monster trucks. Ooh. Uh oh, it crashed. Oh, look at how big this monster truck is. It stands about 12 feet tall. That's four meters in height. To put it into perspective, that's about two of me, Blippi. That was close. Want to see what it's like riding inside a real monster truck? It was really cool seeing inside a real monster truck while it drives. <laughs> it was really bumpy. Meet my friend Peyton. <laughs> he's a crew chief and he's going to tell you a fact about his monster truck. So this monster truck weighs 10,000 pounds. Peyton is so cool. He gets to work on monster trucks all day long. And he even gets to wash their tires. I like monster trucks. Do you guys like monster trucks?
That was so enjoyable learning about monster trucks with you. Come on everyone, let's make